Hey everybody, Sean Tierney here from theautomationblog.com and in this episode of the Automation Minute, I want to show you how you can download free sample code and AOIs right from Rockwell Automation. Now to do so, the first thing you want to do is go to ab.com whoops, and that'll take you over to ab.rockwellautomation.com and typing in ab.com is a lot easier. Um, so once you do that, you want to come over here to downloads. I think this is the easiest way to get there and then click on sample code. And from there, you get this new sample code library uh, web page and um, some great sample code they have up here. I mean, there's all kinds. You can look at it. This PLC code, this HMI code, all kinds of great stuff. But some of the ones I like to point out are um, the building blocks. Um, I just think these are just some great free code that you can get right from Rockwell uh, simple motor control is one of my favorites. It's easy to understand and it has a lot of good stuff. It even comes with some panel view component, panel view 800 screens. Um, good stuff. That's designed for the MicroLogix, but you can use it in the Slick 500 or uh, copy it over into the PLC5 if you wanted to. Um, good stuff. They also have blocks for the Micro 800, so you can check those out too. Um, very good stuff. Now, the other thing I want to show you is you can actually get AOIs up here as well. And here you'll see these are all kinds of free AOIs available for you to download. One of the favorites of those who are using ladder logic only and who used to use the Slick 500 is the SCP or Scale with Parameters Instruction. Now, if you have Function Block, then why not use the Scale Function Block? It has a lot of power in it, a lot of different variables you can tweak in it. But um, if you come from the Slick 500 world or MicroLogix world and you like the SCP and you want to use that in ladder logic, maybe you're doing a small compact logic. You can come up here and grab this and then you don't have to make your own compute block and do slope and offset and all that. You just grab this block. It's totally free. Just select it, accept the uh, terms and conditions, and then you'll download an EXE, which will extract to a zip file and add it into, uh, add it into RS Logics 5000 or Studio 5000. So cool stuff all for free, right from our friends over at Rockwell Automation. You know, with that said, if you'd like to learn how to actually use add-on instructions or actually create your own and test it out live with the Control Logics, check out my course, pac-basics.com. I've recently added a new AOI lesson, which will allow you to really understand AOIs fully and use them. And um, We not only create one from scratch, we use the SCP, we use some of the plant PAX AOIs. So check it out, pac-basics.com. And maybe if you're an expert, but somebody else you know needs help, maybe pick it up for a holiday gift for them. Now, with that said, if you would like to see more free videos like this posted on YouTube, why not become a premium supporter? For as little as $3 a month, you can support the show. And in return, I'll give you $10 worth of free downloads every single month, including episodes of the Automation Minute. And if you have a question on anything I did in today's show, the best place to ask me is theautomationforums.com, where I've created a post just for this um, episode over there. So go there, go to the Automation Minute section, find this episode's post, and ask me anything you want about this episode over there. And that's the, really the best place to ask me questions. I do come to YouTube sometimes, but it's much easier to do it in a forum. Yeah, you can add pictures, you can add links easily. It's just uh, much easier, and I visit that more often. And with that, that's it for this episode of the Automation Minute. Until next time, peace.